Fox, if you know the show, if you've been around, you know that we we actually are knitted close to Jamie Foxx because of, of our location, his, his family uh, being from Terrell, Texas. Let's talk about let's talk about something this morning. Hey, you guys, make sure you guys like, subscribe to our channel. Uh, make sure you guys uh, comment, share. Make sure you let everybody know what's going on over here with Boss Talk One on One on news you can absolutely use. Uh, we got some uh, news updates we want to give you. Want to talk about Jamie Fox? If you know the show, if you've been around, you know that we we actually are knitted close to Jamie Fox because of of our location, his his family. Uh, being from Terrell, Texas. Jamie Foxx uh, was hospitalized on April the 11th. Uh, Korean kind of updated us, his daughter, uh, through Instagram. That's about, it's been vague to none that you hear about it. But this, uh, just a few days ago, Tiffany Haddish spoke out and said that, you know, um, Jamie, you know, she's hearing that he's up and well. You've heard little things come out. So we want to just touch on it a little bit, man. Jamie Foxx is a, a dope uh, uh, actor, uh, entrepreneur, uh, Oscar winning Jamie Foxx. Uh, comedian Jamie Foxx. What can you say about this guy, man, that really explains who he is? He's a freak of nature when it comes down to talent. Nobody has affected us or infected us the way that Jamie Foxx has done uh, this you know, this era. There's nothing like a Jamie Foxx. So when he went down in his health, uh, it was very concerning to everybody, especially here in his hometown. You know, people, you know, we praying for Jamie. People are, are, are looking to say, hey, man, Jamie, man, get better, man. And like I said, family members, uh, people in his hometown concerned, spoke to a few people. These guys are, you know, they're, they're, they're concerned. They're praying, though. You know, Jamie is from a small town called Terrell, Texas, uh, uh, formerly known as uh, Eric Bishop, and well, the way we know him. We know him as Eric Bishop. So you guys, man, uh, I know you guys took the, the, the Jamie Foxx uh, brand and just embraced it. So is, so is everybody else but to grow up with him and to see him go through this man I, I actually met him seen him in Terrell Texas that's the only time I seen him a street was named after him I, I definitely would love to sit down and interview him I know he's going to get better I know he's going to come out of his situation but it was a very you know the movie back in action you know uh, Jeff Gordon pretty much brought out a double and that kind of throw people off because it's like they're not even taking time to wait to see if he's going to get better or some scene they had to do now or there's a deadline that they had to meet but this is very concerning to the people who love Jamie didn't understand how come they moved so quickly to put a double in his place and then for it to hit the airwaves was this publicity for the movie or was this something they had to do because of time gaps uh, don't know but you know, this is a very serious situation that Jamie is facing, and we wanted to just, you know, show from this channel, being that we are in really right here in his hometown, uh, we just wanted to show the, the love and kindness that we have uh, for Jamie. Also, you know, we seen different celebrities uh, speak out. Tracy Morgan spoke out. Uh, you know, he spoke about the fact that he was in a coma for um, days, you know, for. I believe it said 10 days, but whatever the case, Jamie, uh, Jamie Foxx's friends are stepping up and speaking out. Uh, you got to understand, man, Jamie brings on a whole different meaning to when it, to this whole brand uh, ambassador, to this whole entertainment world. These guys, they don't speak on it enough of how much impact that Jamie Foxx uh, has. You know, uh, when you look at... Uh, Tashina Arnold, she spoke about it as well. You know, people are concerned. Uh, she was pretty much just saying, you never even see Martin speak out. And look at Martin just had to speak out and put, hey, we, we riding and praying for Jamie. Jamie has a, uh, a elite crowd of people that's that, that's praying for him and an elite crowd of people that's rooting for him. But like I said again, man, you know, family members, friends in his hometown here are very concerned about Jamie. When you think about... Uh, all the stuff that he's done. Even Steve Harvey had, a, had had spoke up, said that he was strong and in good health, and he couldn't understand why or how this had happened. So, 
Jamie Foxx is not not a you know not somebody that we would like to see you know this type of stuff happening to. But he's human. Health is something that befails us. That's why you have to get your house in order. Jamie Foxx also, uh, you know, his grandmother lived uh, I want to say Bradshaw Street in Terrell, Texas, and I can just promise you they changed that name of it to Jamie Foxx Street, but. Man, this guy, man, like I said, man, for him to come from humble beginning, that little small house on the left-hand side of the road, when you go down that 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 dark road over there, it's right there, man. You can't miss it, but it's just a small home that he was raised in. And when you start to look and see the way that the people down there are, are, are so happy to be, uh, uh, you know, from the same place as Jamie, uh, I, you know, to be part of Jamie's uh, high school that he went to. This stuff here, man, touches us in a mighty way to where it's spiritual when you're going by these places, man, because of who Jamie Foxx is. These people are dedicated fans and love Jamie Foxx. So guys, I'm just telling you right now, I wanted to give an update, being that we are knitted here in the backyard of where Jamie Foxx is from. Um, Jamie Foxx always uh, upbeat, always got people smiling. That's the way Jamie is. So can't wait. They say in the hospital, he's cracking jokes. They say he's cracking jokes again, man. So this is something that I was happy to hear, you know. Um, all all of his friend, uh, Nick Cannon's one of those guys that basically say, hey, man, Jamie, you got you to gotta get well, man. He posted, you know, um, you know, you just got to understand uh, Academy Award winning. Jamie Foxx has so many different hats that he wear. So, you know, all of these guys are going to be speaking up. I'm one of the guys that's going to always root ro and ride for a man from Ray to all the different things, the sitcoms, everything that this guy's accomplished, man. I'm just so happy to be a part of of the legacy by being in knitted with a lot of the family and friends, man. A lot of the people that I speak to personally deal with Jamie. And Jamie's looking uh, good from what they're saying for as the the you know the upbeatness and the jokes and but the main concern is why is he still in the hospital? This is something that kind of concerns everyone. When are they going to release him at the hospital? You know, and, I, I, and that's the thing that you want to see him leave, you know, come home out of that hospital, you know. Hadn't really heard from uh, P. Diddy uh, uh, yet about it, but I think he was a little upset. There was some things coming out about some of those wild parties, man, that, that he had uh, done back in the days with, with P. Diddy. And, and so you, you, don't, you don't see P. Diddy speaking too much about it. You know, P. Diddy kind of kind of hush hush a little bit about it but at the end of the day I know that he loves him and I know that he definitely uh, uh, as well even though he hadn't spoke up hadn't seen anything saying that he he uh you know was speaking out about it but I know for a fact that this guy is uh very concerned you know uh this new movie I hope I know how he is about his movies <laughs> I know how he is about his movies he he looking to get back and I can promise you that he dogmatic he ain't gonna play with him he gonna come up hey man we gonna be joking again I'm telling you but I just wanted to give you guys an update on Jamie Fox condition man and Jamie is a, a pillar man like I said Tiffany Haddish had some update but I wanted to bring you something from Boss Talk 101 news you can use so that you can know that we ride with Jamie down here in Texas man News you can use. Let me see, let me think about this here. So, so. Yeah, yeah, all my notes. Like I done it again, man.